Now open on the promenade deck just aft or behind the funnel. Now could we ask you all to put your ticket somewhere safe, as there will be a ticket inspection and collection later on this evening. So please do put your ticket somewhere safe. Could we also ask you to listen very carefully to the following safety announcement. In the unlikely event of an emergency, you will be informed by a signal consisting of seven or more short blasts, followed by one prolonged blast on the ship's whistle, and by the alarm signal which we will now demonstrate for you below decks. The vessel is equipped with life-saving appliances, which will be launched manually if required by the crew and are sufficient for all passengers on board. In the event of an emergency requiring evacuation, you'll be instructed by the master over this public address system to proceed to the nearest accessible exit, where a crew member will direct you further with regard to the use of the life-saving appliances. Aft or rear end of the vessel, just behind the engine room, open for teas, coffees, light snacks and hot meals. Also, the Britannia Lounge Bar is open on the main deck forward, just in front of the engine room, open for alcoholic refreshments, soft drinks and coffees. You're welcome to bring your drinks up from the bar onto deck. If you do that, could you ask the barman for a plastic glass, please? Also, the ship's souvenir shop will be open for the sale of Balmoral souvenirs and confectionery. That's situated in the forward observation lounge on the promenade deck. That's the lounge just in front of the funnel, just beneath the bridge. Okay. I'll be looking a little way along the coast towards Port Talbot. Uh, this is Swansea Bay, of course, uh, stretching round on the starboard or right-hand side. Away to the Mumbles that you can see ahead of us, fine on our starboard or right-hand bay. And that's Mumbles Head and the little seaside resort of the Mumbles. Unfortunately, the visible end of us and the coastline of the Exmoor National Park. Crossing time to Ilfraco, approximately two hours. Yeah, I can zoom. Yeah, yeah I can. Good telescopic. I can't read the mail though, anyway.